Hello all, this is just a quick guide on how to install War of the Roses correctly in order to play with the rest of the online community. So first things first is obviously install War of the Roses. Next thing you want to do is join the Roses Revive Discord server, I'll post the link down below. So you guys can join it. After you've done that, go to Installations Instructions channel. Click onto the GitHub link like so. After you've done that, you want to download the recent version, which would be version 0.2.3. Click on version 0.2.3. And ignore the source codes, you don't need to download that. All you need to do is download the bundles.zip. So click on bundles.zip. After you've done that, it will download. And all you have to do is click on show in folder. Next step is to right click the bundles folder and extract all. Now, what we need to do is find and locate where we've installed our War of the Roses um, directory. So, after you've right clicked and pressed extract all, it'll pop up this. Um, next step is to click on browse like so. Locate where we've installed the uh, game to. So, I've installed it into the default Windows C boot drive. So, it's just easier. Right, so after we've clicked on the Windows C boot drive, we want to locate Program Files 86. We want to go to our Steam's folder. We also want to go to our Steam Apps folder and go to our Common folder. After we go to our Common folder, we want to go inside the War of the Roses folder and we want to click on the Bundles folder. After you've clicked on the Bundles folder, don't double click it because it will just go inside it. So. Obviously click on bundles folder and select folder. And this is where we want to extract our file. So it will look something like C program files, 86, Steam, Steam Apps Common, War of the Roses, bundle. After you've done that, you click on extract and it will tell you that there's three files that need re replacing. So obviously click on replace the files in the destination. And the only way to determine if you've done it correctly is to see the date modified. It will say 23rd 03 2024. That means all the files are successfully installed. So that bit's now done and out of the way. So the next step is obviously to get your game to work. So if I just boost up the game right now, it'll pop up with network error. This is not what we want. So in order for us to get the game to get inside the game, is to go back to our Discord, Roses Revive Discord server, go to Installation Instructions, and we want to copy this command line prompt like so. So we're going to go Control C after highlighting all this, and uh, we want to go back to our Steam, right click on War of the Roses, click on Properties, General, and Launch Options. And all we have to do is now paste that command line in, like so, so control V. And bam, done. Now, the next step is to boot up your game, and you should be able to play. It'll pop up with latest updates revision 5 failed loading change log just obviously close that down and bam you're in you're able to join multiplayer server browser and join whatever server that you want you can also edit your coat of arms or go to profile edit editor and edit as many loadouts as you want everything is unlocked so have fun everyone um, for those who are still struggling uh, please contact me. Uh, anyway, hope you guys enjoy. Hope this was helpful. And see you on the battlefield.